Hey guys, so today I've just been kind of working on videos and then I did get one uploaded and then I also filmed another video on this look right here. It's kind of an olive green smoky eye and pretty much that's all I've been doing all day. Teddy's doing a lot better again today and I just gave him his other um, like ibuprofen for dogs. I just gave that to him about 30 minutes ago. I just made myself some burritos and um, ate dinner and now I'm probably just going to relax. I'm super full and Teddy's been more active wanting me to play and I took him for a walk outside for about five minutes just because he's been crying all day to go outside so I took him outside for a little bit and we don't have grass around here so I kind of tried to keep him on the the concrete and also on the gravel so I try not to get near the dirt too much just because I'm trying to keep his incision clean. I did let him sleep outside of the kennel last night just because I know he's super uncomfortable sleeping in there and he's not really used to it. And he did fine, like he's able to get up on the bed and stuff now and he doesn't cry or anything. So I pretty much just let him do whatever, if whatever he feels comfortable doing. Um, he's been a little bit trying to get to his incision but um, every time I see him I just get on to him. But it still it looks good. I think it's healing fine. So we'll see how tomorrow goes. But I probably won't really vlog much today. I mean, on a day-to-day -day basis, I don't really do that much. So I really need to do laundry like really, really bad. But I've been putting it off. I have, I have like no towels left. But um, I'll probably do that tomorrow because I don't really feel like doing it tonight. Probably not going to feel like doing it tomorrow either, but eventually I'm going to run out of towels and then I'm not going to have a choice. So, but yeah, I'm so boring. Like, I'm such a homebody. I just prefer to stay home and be around my pets and just, I don't know, do stuff around the house, clean, organize, film, edit, watch movies, play video games, just relax at home. I just like being at home a lot more. Um... Since we have a basketball court now, I'll play basketball from like time to time and I just like to go and sit outside and um, I just like to be home all the time so I'm probably pretty boring. I mean, I'm sure there's a lot of homebodies out there. I'm sure I'm not the only one. I like to go out once in a while but not like go out partying and stuff all the time or anything like that. Once in a while is okay but I'm more for like chill days or just like being home and... Um, if I'm going to hang out with friends, usually it's just like casual get-together. Um, I don't really like going to the movies that much. I'd rather just watch a movie at home. Um, I mean, I do like to go and do stuff like go camping or go to an amusement park or go to the beach. I mean, I like to do stuff like that. Even like shopping. I used to shop in the stores a lot more and like now 95% of my shopping is done online. I just prefer sitting at home and buying stuff online. It's so much more organized and you can just basically type in whatever you're looking for without having to run around an entire store to try and find it. <clears throat> and then also with sizing and stuff and the stores are always so disorganized. So I don't know, I love shopping online. I know sometimes it can be iffy, but 90% of the time what I buy online will work for me, so it's not really a big issue. I don't really have issues with things not fitting. Sometimes um, shoes don't really fit that well, but that's the only thing that I might have a problem with because I can range from like a 7.5 to an 8, so like in heels usually I'm more of a 7.5 and, and then for like sneakers and stuff typically I wear an 8, so... I really wish that I could shop at Home Goods online. That would be so great because I love that store. But I guess it's kind of fun to just go to the store because they always have new stuff. So if you go like a couple times a week, you're always going to find something new there. And it would probably be kind of difficult just because if they only had like a few select things in stock. And I don't know, maybe it wouldn't be a good idea, but I still think that... 
there was a home goods online I'd probably shop way more than I've been watching like a lot of crime shows lately so I've been like really into those like all the ones on ID I've been like so into those and then of course I love watching um, The Walking Dead, Better Call Saul um, I like Face Off but I'm pretty behind on that one I like Teen Mom, The Voice um, I like all of those shows I also watch Once Upon a Time, but I'm like three behind on that one too because I kind of lost a little bit of interest in it this season, but I need to catch up and get back into that show because I did really like it and I've been following it for a while. Um, and then of course I watch Roseanne like on repeat all the time, like over and over and over. I've seen every single one probably like five or six times just because there's no other shows out there like it and I like that they still run it because... It's so witty, and the comebacks on it are just so hilarious, and there's no other show like that. I mean, they have all these reality shows, and they have so many just, in my opinion, like, stupid shows. And the comedy in that one is just, I don't know, you don't find it anymore. I love those, and I'll always probably watch those forever as long as they're still running, just because, like I said, there's no comedy like that. And I actually got more sleep last night because Teddy was being a lot better because he's not in that much pain anymore. Um, or not as bad as he was. It's more like discomfort now. Um, so he went to bed with me pretty early. We went, we laid down like around 12, I think. And then I woke up around 8.30, I think, so... Yeah, I got a lot more sleep. I feel way more refreshed today, and that's why I was like, I finally have enough energy to film a video, so that's what I decided to do. So I'm so happy that I finally got to film a video. I still have a couple other ones that I need to edit and work on, but um, I really enjoy making videos. It's so much fun, and I get to express my creativity, and I don't know, it's just fun. But yeah, my Saturday's been pretty boring. I really haven't done much, like I said, but that's kind of like every day. I mean, I don't really do that much. And right now, it's about 7 o'clock, so... I mean, when you film and edit during the day, your day goes by so fast. It's like gone. You could be sitting there for 6 or 7 hours, and it would feel like you're only there for a couple hours, and then the day's gone. I mean, when you film and edit, it takes up like an entire day, it feels like, so... That's why the days go by so fast when I film or when I edit because like setting everything up and then picking what I'm going to film about and then filming the video and then taking the photos and um, uploading it and all that stuff takes like all day long. So, But yeah, I got a virus on my laptop the other day so I had to reformat it and then I'm barely like slowly adding things back to it and for filming I usually use this program to remote shoot. And I don't know where the disc went, and I, I kind of didn't want to download any of that online just because Canon doesn't make it so simple just to go and find the software. And I didn't want to download it from, like, a third party. So, um, I had saved most of my stuff onto a disc um, when I reformatted. So, I had a hell of a time, because I have Windows 10, and I had a hell of a time trying to get the program back onto my laptop just because... I had to share it, they had to be on the same network, they had to be in the same home group, I had to turn on to share it, and it was just like a big mess, but I finally figured it out, and um, I was able to get that on there, but it took me probably like an hour to two hours, or at least it felt like that long, trying to get that on my laptop to get everything set up to film, because I probably would have been done filming like way earlier, but I totally forgot that I didn't have that program on there, and it's so helpful to use my laptop to remote shoot that way I can adjust all the light settings I can press to record or to stop recording I can take pictures um, I can focus myself and stuff like that so it's really helpful um, it makes filming so much easier because before I did that I had such a hell of a time trying to focus my camera it was terrible I would like set something in my chair to try and focus it but most of the time most of the time it wouldn't even focus it right, so it's way easier now with my laptop. So pretty much I have to have that on there when I'm filming because if I don't have that program, it's just like, takes away too long. And I'm like, am I in focus? Am I in focus? I can't tell. So, but yeah, 
I'm probably just going to go relax and um, probably just watch some TV. I might play The Division because I've been, um, I finally reached level 30 and I'm trying to get more familiar with the game. I finally got into the Dark Zone. So I'm kind of trying to familiar myself in that and I'm also trying to level up in that because I think I'm only like a 14 or 15 in the dark zone. But so far I really like the game. I played a lot of um, Destiny and I have kind of got sick of it because you pretty much do the same stuff over and over and over. The same missions, like the same everything. So I was really glad that there was a new game that came out. And I know people really either really love it or really hate it. And I like it, so I haven't like played it out yet to where I'm sick of it. Um, I only have one character, and like I said, I'm barely exploring the dark zone and leveling up there. So, so far I like it, and I know that they're coming out with some new stuff for it, so that'll be pretty cool. I'm hoping that they expand on the servers because it's really glitchy and it has so many problems. Like every time I get on, usually I'll have an error code. It's always a different error code. And unless I like hard reset my Xbox, it does not go away and I'll just keep getting it throughout the game. But um, besides that, it's fun and yeah, so I'll probably just go watch TV or play that a little bit. And I will talk to you guys probably tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.